Hello everyone, welcome to Book My Scans. Let us get to know the significance of PET CT scan in pancreatic cancer treatment. What is pancreatic cancer? Pancreatic cancer begins in the tissues of your pancreas. Pancreatic cancer typically spreads rapidly to nearby organs. Pancreatic cancer occurs when a malignant tumor forms in the pancreas. One sign of pancreatic cancer is diabetes, especially when it occurs with weight loss, jaundice or pain in the upper abdomen that spreads to the back. Other symptoms are depression, blood clots, fatigue, yellowing of skin. Before proceeding further in pancreatic cancer, let's have an overview on pancreas. So, what is pancreas? Pancreas is a pear-shaped gland located in the abdomen between the stomach and the spine. It has two major components, the exocrine and endocrine. The exocrine component is made up of ducts and small sacs called acini. It makes specialized proteins called enzymes that are released into small intestine to help the body digest and break down food, particularly fats. The endocrine component made up of cells lumped together in different location within this part of the pancreas to make a specific type of hormone like insulin. How does pancreatic cancer form. Pancreatic cancer occurs when cells in your pancreas develop mutations into their DNA. These mutations cause cells to grow uncontrollably and to continue living after normal cells would die. These accumulating cells can form a tumor. Untreated pancreatic cancer spreads to nearby organs and blood vessels. Chronic inflation of the pancreas, smoking, obesity, diabetes may increase the risk of pancreatic cancer. Types of pancreatic cancer There are two types of pancreatic cancer, exocrine tumors and endocrine tumors. Exocrine tumors. These are the most common type of pancreatic cancer and adenocarcinoma is the most common type of exocrine tumor. These tumors usually start in the ducts of the pancreas. Endocrine tumors. These are also called pancreatic neuroendocrine tumors. They are much less common than exocrine tumors, making a about 1% of pancreatic cancers. A pancreatic neuroendocrine tumor can be functioning or non-functioning. Why is a PET CT scan needed? PET scans do not work for all cancers. In general, PET scan is mostly useful for rapidly growing cancers such as Hodgkin's disease, kidney cancer, pancreatic cancer, and gynecological cancer. A PET scan will produce a three-dimensional color image of your body, which will show how body tissues are working and also what they look like. It can be used to help diagnose cancers. It can help doctors tell the difference between a scar tissue or an active cancer in the body. PET scan for pancreatic cancer shows whether there is a tumor present in the pancreas. It helps to identify the stage of cancer is, shows whether the cancer has spread to other parts of the body, helps your specialists decide the best treatment for you, shows how current treatment is working, identify the difference between scar tissue and tissues that are cancerous. Let us have a short overview on PET CT scan. A PET positron emission tomography scan is an imaging test that allows your doctors to check for disease in your body. 
the scan uses a special dye that has radioactive tracers. These tracers are either swallowed, inhaled or injected into a vein in your arm depending on what type of the body is being examined. PET scan are the most common used to detect cancer, heart problems and brain disorders. A PET CT scan combines a CT scan and a PET scan. It gives detailed information about your cancer. The CT scan takes a series of x-rays from all around your body. The PET scan uses a mildly radioactive drug to show up areas of your body where cells are more active than normal. PET scans are sensitive and are able to detect cancers that are more than 1 cm in size. PET scans can detect the spread of cancer. It is critical at the start of the cancer process to accurately stage the patient. PET scans are used to monitor patients who are in remission to be certain that cancer has not returned. For this reason, in some centers, PET scans are repeated 6 to 12 months after finishing treatment. Log on to book my scans and get the best prices for PET CT scans in multiple cities in India. Please do like, share and subscribe and don't forget to comment below. And thank you for watching.